Then I'm going to take the black eyeliner and go on the water rim. Just gently hold it with your pinky. If you haven't done this before, it will tickle, but I promise you, you'll get used to it. You want to get right next to your lashes. You can just do little baby strokes. You don't have to draw a straight line. And then just come upward at the outer edge and kind of fill that area in because you're going to blend it out in just a minute. So you're drawing an angle right there on the outer corner. And then you're going to take the really cool little tool. It's like an eraser rubber thingy, but what it does is it blends beautifully. And you use the tip edge of this, soften this line up to make it more smoky. And I'm really blending it up into the corner here. blending it into that plum color and coming up into the crease with it. We're going to take our CoverGirl Perfect Point Plus in Black Onyx Eyeliner, the twisty kind. It's really cool. And I'm going to add eyeliner to about three quarters of the eye, as you can see on the side. It's not all the way across. After I've lined with the black liner on the water line, I'm going to come back with the Pretty Plum from our quartet of colors. And I'm going to use a tiny little pen type brush. It's a brush, it's not a sponge. Tiny little thing. And just soften up the outer corner of the under eye. Curl these real good. Last mascara. This is the Waterproof from CoverGirl in black. I love it. It's got a really fat brush, so it thickens up your lashes. And the way you want to put it on, start at the base, press, wiggle side to side. Press, wiggle. Press, wiggle. And then I'm going to take my CoverGirl Eye Enhancer in Snow Blossom. And I'm going to use the little sponge applicator that comes in here, the little pointed one. This is a really pretty shimmery white. And then just tap it on top of that. We are going to move on to the concealer. I always do the eyes first. And I like to mix two concealers. We're going to use CoverGirl Fresh Complexion. I'm mixing two shades on my hand. And I just kind of use this all over wherever I think I need a little bit. And I use a foundation brush like this. Mix the two colors. We're using CoverGirl Fresh Look Pressed Powder. And I'm using a big fluffy kind of flat brush. Just pat it on. And then buff it in. Okay, so we just applied our powder and now the next step is going to be blush. I'm using a bright pink blush. Anything that kind of complements the pink in the eyes. And always tap off your brush. Smile. Apply it to the apples of your cheeks. So that gives a really fresh look with what we're going for. Before we get to the lips, we are going to fill in the eyebrows because we've got dramatic eyes, cheeks, lips. The brows frame the face, so you really don't want them 
um, too toned down when you have a dramatic look. And I'm just going to use an eyebrow pencil from CoverGirl. It's called Brow and Eye Makers in Soft Blonde. Whoa. And you just make little pencil strokes where your hair already grows, just like you're making little pieces of hair in your eyebrow. Very simple. For the lips, I'm really excited about this product. It is the Outlast Lip Stain from CoverGirl. And then you're going to basically paint this on. So here we go. See? Beautiful. It creates just this beautiful matte red stain and it feels like nothing on your lips. Lastly, I'm gonna add some lashes to this and then we'll be done. I'm gonna do the thing that nobody should ever, ever do. Oh, everything's falling around me. I'm gonna use a safety pin, so don't watch this. So, there we go. All done. Hope you enjoy it.